Welcome to, well, uh, let's welcome to some fishing games, games about fishing. Um, this is the F Itchio Fishing Jam, fishing, well, uh, fishing horror jam. Can't be, that can't be right. That, that can't be right. There, there's no way a fishing game can be scary. So we're going to start with The Thing in the Lake. This is a game by Chipro, Ch Chiro Pitaram. Chiro Pitaram. Um, as always, you can find all of the uh, the game information in the description below this video if you're watching this on YouTube. Um, and you should go out and support indie, indie developers. Indie developers. I very much like there. Does that one? That doesn't work at all. The thing in the lake. Is this intentionally muted? How to play. You take your fishing rod. Time to fish. Are you muted? Is this, is this muted? Should be muted. I guess it's just, it's just it just doesn't have sound. Inspect boat, yes. With fishing rod in hands, you come closer to the boat. You take a look. There's dry blood on the boat. Must be from that poor dog. The owner must have left the boat here, wanting to forget everything that happened. You too wish you could forget certain things. Like those dreams... You can see claw marks on the boat side from that incident. They met it, that thing. Will you have the same fate? Will you be able to see it here beyond your dreams? You don't think the owner will mind if you take the boat. You bring it to the water. If your theory is right, you're doomed to meet it soon enough. Why am I doing? <laughs> Why do I want to do this? Here are the facts. Your uncle's dead. He drowned. That sucks. That much everyone knew. He was also disfigured when they found him. With a fish that hungry for your uncle's face. They specifically ate his face. Why? Why specifically his face? His eyes and mouth were gone. Instead, animal's body parts were found inside. Wow. An eye for an eye, a snap for a mouth. Sure. There was no connection between the animals killed in New York Trees Park and parts found in your uncle. But you don't really think it's all a coincidence. That is why you decided to look for answers about your uncle's death. About what you've been going through since your last fishing trip with him. As soon as everything's connected, like the dreams. Ah, uh, those dreams. Those nightmares. Is this such an interesting, weird concept? Oh my god, the thing in the lake is coming into the boat. You hoped you were not the only one who thought about... After hearing about your uncle's tragedy, he came into your mind as his own death was similar to your uncle's. No, not similar. Identical! No one mentioned his name, nor his death, but you remembered him... You read about him and your uncle. Sorry about his dreams. It was your uncle's uncle. It's it's an uncle-based curse. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, I hate this. Both of them had the same dreams before they died. The same ones you had before coming to the lake. Why would you go to the lake then? Why? <laughs> all right. We, here's the pattern that we know. You have the dreams. You go to the lake. You get killed. And I'm like, all right, we're on step two. Your theory was both of them came to the lake to find answers, but they only found their deaths. Oh, God. You're kind of cute, though. Both of them died in the lake. All of them, had all of you had triggered those dreams at some point when you were came here to fish. You all fall into the water once and felt that particular feeling on your ankles. If something was trying to take you deeper with it, but it's just a feeling, right? Feels this thing came home with you from that day. It took parts of your dreams. Was the protagonist of your nightmares? The thing was dangerous. You knew it. You know how long you should not have come to the lake because you, yeah, you really should have come back to the lake. You share the same fate as those two men, and yet here you are. You thought that, and you were not an uncle yourself. You might have breaking some kind of pattern. Oh, God. Creature speaks. It wants you. Great. Something grabbed you. You fell into the water. Boop, 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 boop. It feels weird. You can't breathe. You can't see. Yet you're still alive. Follow the bubbles towards your heart. Boop, boop, boop. Creature is calling you. You want to follow it. You need to see it. Is it a siren? Is it a siren? Forbidden siren? There's no turning back now. Wow, <clears throat> this guy's got some, some, some serious packs. It's time to make a choice. The creature wants you. Your uncle's uncle. Your uncle. Does this creature have a crush on me? 
Make your choice. Let's stay. You survived. The creature is happy. It wants to love you, and you to love it back. It wants you to come visit again, and again, and again, and again. Okay. Well, happy ending for everyone, I suppose. Let's start at the top with brineflow.exe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, I thought that was a sword. I must bring him his parts. Hata. What is happening? Aha. I can't see down. How am I supposed to know where his parts are? Who is him? I have so many questions. Man, there's been a real resurgence in- Whoa, whoa, whoa! Let's get on the boat! I cannot fish for a boat. Is this one of them surreal... Haha! Woo! Them surreal situations. I've just now realized I don't have the patience for fishing. Jesus. Come to me! Caught a trash fish. This true fucking fish is garbage. Is this based on the angle of my? Is the angle of my fishing pole based on my camera angle? Oh, hello. Hello, Secret Grove. I'm going to fish in you. It's probably not going to be a lot of fish. Oh, I took the boat to get to this island. I see. The island of texture tearing. Interesting that it looks like these are like a bunch of planes, not like a um, one of those generated landscapes that you can make in, in Unity. Oi, oi, oi. I said I want to fish in here. Oh, immediately. I caught a very fine fish. You can only imagine what the logic is for when fish decide to come to you and how many clicks it takes to get them out of the water. Am I just putting the fish in my backpack? That's horrible. Oh! Great! Good news! I... <laughs> I caught a part of him. I must reassemble my boyfriend. He was... <laughs> ah! What the hell is up with these games, man? I got his leg! Okay, so it looks like I just need to spam fishing. I'm just astonished that people do this sort of thing for fun. Like fishing. What a very fine fish. Is that a human skull? This very fine fish has a human's face on it. We're gonna try one or, one or two more times to see if I can't get parts of my... I do make fishing lures for fly fishing. No, fish. How is... Okay, like legitimately, I do not know this. How is fly fishing different from regular fishing? Like, I'm honestly curious to know. Oh, hello. Is there a pit? What might hide parts of my boyfriend? No, it's an arrow? No, it's a... What? What the hell is this? That's all I can do to interact with it. It's like a dirt angel. That must be where he landed and then split into a bunch of different pieces. Goodbye, fishing line! A grave, perhaps. Oh, yeah, where somebody might bury a dead body. Come to me! I got. Oh, God. 
<laughs> ah, ah, <laughs> all right all right this is earl's day off we're earl i barely remember last night is this redneck rampage but i guess i lost my wedding ring in the lake oh that's that's not good that's bad earl my wife says don't come back until you find it or you get murdered probably in some fish's gut by now Well, at least I got an excuse to do some fishing. Hell of a way to spend my day off fishing. Cha! Oh my God! This is exactly like that one part in Sonic Adventure. Come to me, fishy. Come, come to me. I am nowhere close to this fish. Alright, let me try that again. Uh, ha! Gotta overshoot the fish a little bit. <laughs> oh, oh, he's interested. Oh, yes! I got him. I assume this is exactly what fish is. That's a good fish right there. That's a gigantic fish right there. So any any tips in chat about how to how to catch these these bastards? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh he's interested. Come on. Up to me. I uh oh. <laughs> there we go. He's not even stuck on the hook. What is this? Just a whelp. Yeah, just a regular sized fish. As opposed to the friggin' lake monster that I caught just a second ago. Go. I need a key to open this gate. You do? It doesn't have a lock on it. Can I... Some frame-perfect skips here? No. Okay, is this what you want? <gasps> Come on, man, I only have one means of interacting with the game world. Give me the key. Fish, grant unto me your secrets. I'm gonna nail this fish right in the noggin with this lure. Oh yeah, oh yeah, he loves it! That's some good eating, Jesus Christ. What the hell's up? Better wrap this up before it gets too dark. No, more fish. What are they feeding these things? They're so dang big. Hey, hey, behind you! Hey, yoo -hoo. Fish? Not interested. Okay, I actually have to, <laughs> have to throw it within the fish's line of sight. Ha ha! Oh yeah, you love it. Look at how interested you are. Oh, you're <laughs> the biggest. Not the biggest fish, but I ain't complaining. Maybe I'm supposed to get the key on day two? No, it can't be, because it's only Earl's one day off. It's not, not, it's not five nights at Early's. I'm gonna investigate this, and if you're... Oh, okay. Well, the fish does not want me investigating whatever this is. Hang on. Uh, fish. Oh, oh, okay. He suddenly doesn't care. Got a large lump of flesh. Great. This thing's pretty heavy. Better let my lure sink even deeper. You, you can just put a lead weight on it, man. I don't know anything about fishing, but even I can sur sur surmise. <laughs> it's not even on the thing. Oh, I see. Okay, scoot forward slightly. Give me that key, baby. <laughs> I like how I like how nonchalant the key grab situation is. I got a key. Key to the gate. Must drop this along with the ring. Oddly enough, the ring is nowhere near the key. But okay. 
Fish love to eat shiny things. They're just like magpies. I could have sworn I left that gate open. Oh no. The gate's haunted. Like, if this were 1% less unnerving, I imagine it would be a pretty interesting, like, fishing game all on its own right. Will I be able to do this? Or will my line get caught up in those trees? Nope. My line clips through everything. It doesn't care. Please? My dude. My actual factual guy. Uh. Hope you guys like the sound of lines being reeled in. Oh, I caught it. It's not even touching! Come on! Caught a key. Let's drop this one too. Bro, you got a hole in your pocket. Like, what are you doing throwing all your keys? Another gate? Was that always here? Now I'll catch Del Lago. This part of the lake is huge. I think it's probably sank to its deepest parts. Where would that? Oh, that gigantic sinkhole right there. I don't even know if the fish is anywhere near here. There it is. The fish is sliding in out from off frame. They eat the ring. Looks like it hasn't eaten in a long time. Are you kidding? That, that fish is literally the size of your entire body. I'm terrified to find out what he thinks actual fish are supposed to look like. Lands a fucking baleen whale and he's like, I don't know man, it's a little tiny. Fish, fish, fish. I'm clipping through the ground in excitement. Come on. If I can't see the fish, then I just don't even know if it's, like, interesting. Oh, it is. Here it is. Fish sliding in from out of frame. Oh. 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 <laughs> I love how, they, how they're rotating on the Y. There we go. How they're rotating on the Y axis, like, oh. And then a normal fish. Lost my appetite for fish by now. Look, I'm, I'm such a living creature. You should bite me. No ring. Fish even eat rings? Am I wasting my time? feel like I'm being watched. By the fish. See, I told you, you're being watched. The fish are judging you. Hey. Ooh, look at this. Look at this erotic lure. Oh. <laughs> ah! Oh! Holy crap! What the hell is that thing? Jesus Christ! No! I don't want. You can have it. You can have the fish, man. Here, I'll bring it to you. Ha! Oh, it's under my boat. Oh, good. God, bit me. This fish is a mouthful of teeth, as most fish do. Oh my God! What the hell was that thing? I actively hate it. I don't want to cast my line anymore. This thing's gonna jump out and absolutely eat my butt. That was an amazing reveal, actually. <laughs> this this is why I'm scared of fishing. Cause what if what if that thing is under my boat waiting to eat my butt? Is it gone? I don't know if it would be worse if it was gone or not. Fish is making a sound like it's purring or growling. It's a it's a catfish. <laughs> This fish is crying? What kind of fish are these? No, that's just water, man. Uh, I heard it splash nearby like something can't be very late. <laughs> the area around this fish's eyes appears to be moist for some reason. It's like, Earl, Earl, I need you to pay attention. Alright? Listen to me. Okay, come on. Yes! I got the lump of flesh. It's entirely inanimate. I need like a mag... <laughs> You know, a magnet, something that's heavy that sinks to the bottom of this lake that would attract the metal key. I got it. You want some too, fish? Are you very small or just very far away? Got a key. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But why would I go back there?
His wife is there. Oh. <laughs> oh. Nowhere left to go but down. I mean, I can't swim, so I guess I'm just gonna have to do this. Ha. Huh. I see it! It's a disembodied hand. Eh. 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 Yes. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Is he seriously gonna be like, oh, that's where my hand went. I'm wondering about that. Is this my wife's hand? I need to get back to the house now. With some alacrity, please. It's the hando. <laughs> when, I saw, when I first saw that fish in my Garmer school notebook with hand on its fin. Oh no! I'm trapped! This is somehow less horrifying than semen for the Dreamcast. Was I my wife the entire time? Oh, Jesus Christ. Well, it's got both hands, so it can't be my wife. Oh, great. It's developed by Airdorf. That explains a lot. I recently received a letter from an old friend. Close to the mic. Close to my heart. And it was an invitation to a fishing trip. It'd be just like old times, my friend wrote. A wave of nostalgia washes over me as I reminisce. It's been well over ten years since I'd last been there. As children, we'd visit their uncle's cabin by the lake. The lake always had the largest trout you ever done seen. I saw their game I compose you are. I made up my mind. I immediately wrote back, accepting my friend's offer. Not knowing it would be my biggest mistake. I should have never went on that damned... Fishing... Vacation. <laughs> Look at that smile. A bit more rundown, I remember. Is my uncle even here? Well, only one way to find out. Last one in's a rotten flounder. Yeah, we have to do some speed tech and uh, get the proper... Trouting for this game. <laughs> I'll see myself out. No one's here. Oh, well, more cabin for us. The murder cabin. Yeah, no one's died here. Yet. This place hasn't had any visitors in a while. <laughs> hey, so it looks like we got a little bit of daylight left. Still time for a little fishing. I'll be outside. Grab those poles and meet me out back. Off he goes. There's mad cobwebs everywhere. Come on, man. This place is a health and safety nightmare. But it's more important that we go fish. It's a poster of a fish. Where are the rods? Is this a rod? Alright, that's one. Just need one more. Oh, I thought it was a lamp. That's a rod. That's two. Now let's fish. I can dual wield these. Fish won't know what's coming. Hey, buddy. Don't worry about worms. Tonight's bait's on me. But you're getting your own bait tomorrow. We got three worms. Well, wormy boys. We got three, count them three, wiggly boys. Ah, just like I remember it. A bit more green, though. Really? Breathe it in, buddy. That's some fresh air. Now let's christen the start of an awesome vacation. Looks like there's something right in front of us. Go ahead and reel in a big one, my friend. How do I... Oh, God, it's a first-person fisher. It's a fish-person shooter. Ha -cha! Oh, I absolutely blew it. Oh, it's like a golfing sim. That's kind of clever. Oh, 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 oh. Great. <laughs> well, not the most edible fish. But at least we're doing our part cleaning the lake. Plus, if you find the other one, you got a new pair of shoes. All right, let's get back to fishing while we can. Is there, like, any indicator, or do I just start firing wildly? Ha. Huh. Is that ha? Huh? The gentleman's sport. Come on, horror! You caught a Great. How is the tin can the same size as the shoe? I don't think there's any fish in here, man.
Well, I can say this is certainly easier to reel fish in than those last couple of games. And there's nothing horrible in the lake. I got a shrimp! <laughs> Alright, I think that's enough fishing for today. Oh no, man, come on, another 700, another 700 and those will actually be able to eat something. Where is my friend? There he is. Ah, fishing is what my soul needed. Reeling and dealing does the body good. Go to bed? Bedtime. Read in... What? Inuit mythos. There are many gods within the Inuit beliefs. One such god is the goddess Sedina, goddess of the sea. Hers is a tragic tale with many different versions. Either good or bad, depending on the tale. Each version features the same conclusion. She drowns. I'll read some more tomorrow. Okay. I love cliffhangers. The cellular door is locked with three pad... Oh, three of them. I guess gonna... Mm, I guess I'm gonna have to get... Bait some... Bait! Bait! What? I'm dowsing! I'm dowsing for bait! <laughs> how many... How many worms will I be able to get? This is not what I was expecting in a fishing vacation. So there's a mini game to determine how long a mini... I got worms! There's a mini game to determine how long of a mini game I can play. I had ten whole worms, baby. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Is this what you want? Is this what you want from me? X is the A button, Z is the B button. Where are you seeing this? Oh, okay. All right, now, now I will master this. You are mine, fish. The, 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 the mash! Oh, an actual catfish, huh? The bait's almost gone. Time to bring out the dynamite. All right, fish. I'm done fucking around. Do you use quite, quite this much? Oh my god. Windows doesn't, doesn't even know what's going on. That was a shrimp! All right, I think that's enough fishing for today. Player's getting upset because there's no... There's no... Oh, hello. You can use... I was making this game I was making this game hard on purpose as a joke. Oh, it's just you. You scared me. Sorry, I just had the weirdest stream last night. Catfish shrimp in a chink can. I get the <laughs> I did the work so you get the good cam. Do you want al dente? Right on, okay, so last night. I woke up, or rather I thought I woke up. Couldn't move my body, but I could see. Freaky, right? It's freaky. My eyes started to adjust to the dark. My window came into view. It stared at it. I feel like I was staring forever, but then just as it was about to nod off back to sleep, I saw it. <laughs> Boo, haha. -ha. Did I scare you? Alright, enough spooking. Let's get to hooting. Fire Nation attack. The window came to life and killed me. Caw, says the birds. I want it. I want that fish. Ah, oh, give me that fish. A lobster. Andrew, you're scaring the fish. I'm scaring a lot more than just the fish. This thing is lousy with crustaceans. Oh yeah, come here, come on. The, the mash is really critical to this game. Come on, come on, come, 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 come to me, come to me, fish. Come to me, this is your destiny, fish. You cannot, cannot evade it. What? So it looks like if you don't have to mash A and B, then you're just getting something inanimate. Come to me. You are now within my clutches, whatever you are. You caught up. Why? Who is throwing all these fucking tin cans in here? <laughs> He's having tin can again tonight. Yeah, the ray is mine. The manta ray is mine. I'm cooking it. 
I don't know how, but I'm cooking it. You tried a adding heat to it, Andrew? Oh, yeah. You caught up. Oh, wow, it's actually a sponge. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, come here, come here. You caught up. What? Starfish, well known for living in freshwater lakes. I'm gonna fish up the corpse one of these times. I wouldn't be surprised. What could be in the lake? Is that a dead body? Oh yeah, oh yeah, it's something good. I can I can feel it. I can feel it because of the mechanics. You caught up. That's a feisty starfish. Probably the corpse of my best friend. The corpse of my best friend's uncle. Of course, I'm my best friend's uncle's wife. All these games share a universe. They're all in the same lake. You caught a yeah, I know I caught a damn kin tin can. <laughs> you caught a worm. What the hell? Worm's like, I'm just as confused as you, to be honest. You caught yourself. You caught a all right, I think that's enough fishing for today. If you want to call it fishing... I think I caught one fish. How do you lose a worm when you catch a tin can? <laughs> tin can eat it. Those tin cans are vicious. All right, great news, man. I got enough fucking random crap to fill out an entire aquarium. Read more mythos? Hell yeah. In this version of Sin Cinda's tale, she is a lovely maiden. Pursued by many of the local men, she rejects them all. As her father grows impatient, he meets an unknown hunter. Hunter requests his daughter's hand in marriage. Just the hand! Have the offer giving away his daughter's hand. Only one more day of fishing left, my friend. A weekend isn't long enough. I want more time. I'm wishing for more fishing. Okay. Go to bed? Yes. Oh, shit. There was someone next to the tree? Oh, no! I should have invented... Are you still up? If not, then get up. How's about we do a little night fishing? Go night fishing? Hell yeah. All right, awesome. Meet me outside when you're ready. I'm not ready. <laughs> hey, I've got some reading to do. The father in his haste had just given his child to a bird creature merely disguised as a man. <gasps> what? That's impossible. Birds don't exist. Determined to raise wrong, he went after his daughter. Rowing in his kayak, the man approaches the birdman's lair. He charges inside, saves his daughter, and escapes. Shortly soon after, the creature learns the bride escaped. He takes flight, giving chase to its runaway bride. <laughs> wow, so this is lake at night, eh? Neat. And there's plenty of moonlight. I can see okay. Well, okay, I can't really see anything, but that's fine. Only well, needs to start big catches. Let's fish on, buddy. I'm gonna catch a ghost. I, I am 100% positive. The ghost of a tin can. Okay. I'm gonna catch so many tin cans. They're nocturnal creatures. The tin can. Is it a tin can? You caught up. Oh my god! Just dredge the lake at this point. You got a tin shrimp. Oh, a tin can full of shrimp. Like, well, I guess that is cutting out the middleman, I suppose. Okay. So apparently this middle area is sort of a dumping ground for garbage. So let's really, let's really get out over here. I'm just slapping the keyboard, really. <sighs> I hate you, starfish. I'm gonna fling you like a ninja star directly back into the lake. Give me the garbage. I gotta get that garbage. I'm the trash man. I live off of it. Oh yeah, that's if I if I miss the timing. Yawn, all right, let's get on. Yeah, I know. It was super exciting. Cut all these fucking tin cans. Anybody? Any ghosties? Any ghosties or ghoulies? Goblins or gremlins? All right. 
<laughs> That's what night fishing is like. I don't know what I was so afraid of. Oh, yeah, the dark. Anyway, thanks for fishing. We didn't catch shit. I'm going to make you eat the sponges. Well, it's our last day. I feel like I've lost all my energy to fish. Something with the lake. It just seems off. Got to end the trip on a good note. One last trip to the lake. What do you say? Hell yeah. Didn't realize this game had an end. I thought it was just constant fish puns and getting very casually haunted. There's not really much worm strat. Other than mashing. Oh boy, do you ever have to mash to get these worms out. There might be <laughs> There might be the 12 tank cans I eat. Oh my god, what are you doing? What did I just catch? What? It's just an animal skeleton, that's all. Yeah, you're probably right. I think we've got enough worms. Let's go fish. I can honestly say I did not expect to find the dead body in the dirt. Like, <laughs> of all things to, to happen in this game, unearthing a grave was not one of them. Ha! My friend's gonna kill me. Yeah, he's gonna bury me in the lake. An actual fish! Dead body surrounded by 2,000 tin cans. He was the tin can murderer. He buried his victim under a bunch of empty tin cans and let them cut themselves to death on the lids. Oh, it's something big. Oh, it's a big one. Oh, it's an entire corpse. I can feel it. It's really struggling. A pike. A 50-inch pike. Damn, son. Considering I think maybe 15% of what I caught this entire weekend was edible. I got a alec. <laughs> I got a shark. All right, I think that's enough fishing for today. Yeah, we ended it on a real high note when I caught it when I got that fucking kitchen sponge. You should have told me that this was just a uh, sunken landfill. Yeah, let's go. I don't know about you, buddy, but I'm ready to get out of here. I'll be out in the car when you're ready. No rush. Read more mythos? While pursuing his bride, the creature makes a plea. It calls upon the sea spirit for help with a capture. As the pair escapes, the kayak is rock oh, rocked by huge waves. As what's in the father reacts hastily yet again. He tosses his child overboard into the icy waters. Said in the surface is grasping, uh, grasping a uh, hold of the kayak's side. With a swift motion, her father's axe swings down. Key fit into one of the padlocks. So the door is locked with two padlocks left. Okay, well. Is there the way I'm going to shake the feeling of uneasiness? Left with questions. I knew their answer. What was in the lake that night? What happened to my uncle and his family? Starts to haunt me at night. I got the bad end. It's been a while since I last heard my friend. When I last wrote to them. I asked if they felt the same nagging, nagging compulsion. I had to return to the cabin to get some answers. I wrote back saying they seemed more to use the cabin stuff to the bottom of the lake with all the other garbage. When you made a door, we didn't program to do anything. It's it's fucking locked. My curiosity didn't sink so easily. I made up my mind. I'm going back to the cabin. Who has the hooks in my brain? It's reeling me in. My suspicions were buoyed. I just hope I don't become fish food. Ending B. Thank you for playing. This is the tale of a Viking who likes to fish. Oh, thank God, I have more. I have no camera control. Time to fish walks away from the lake. Am I a Yotan? Hello. You look like a fish. Oh, you bastard. Come here. Press C to board. Oh, I'm supposed to be on the. I'm supposed to be on this. There we go. I'm surfing. Behold the great flood of a thousand years. It dresses deep creatures, pale and blind. When lightning strikes twice, the fish gods tears of red wine and blood mixed against the foam. What the hell is that thing? I'm gonna fish it. 
The harpoon sharpened with the sea eye, the god great shadow casting the waves, spear spun the with sonic cry, fish warrior who had come from stone. These are going to be teeth. Wow, this guy's got a hell of an arm. Eyes bright with the light of sun, long live. The hair salt crusted, long gray with age. Or is this warm and really thick with frost? Endless something, something into something, something. Please give me more poetry or something to interact with, because otherwise I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, sick moves. Can I crawl into your mouth? Please, just end it. Yeah, that's amazing. Maybe I'm supposed to climb up onto this. If not, then I do not know. Okay, all right. Normally these sorts of towers would be something to like go for in... Hello. What is this? Prepare to die. Is this the land of the gods? Oh boy. I'm showing my butt. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, I can't throw in the water. Quick, upside down. Oh, pfft. Whoop. We love Shadow of the Colossus around here. Whoa, 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 whoa! So it seems like the most... Like, the biggest penalty this thing inflicts on me is the fact that I fall off my surfboard. Which, joke's on you, I was gonna do that anyway. Bleh! Okay, can I get him away from this, um, pillar? This Pilar. You're losing health too, gradually. Is that my health? Is that my health? I thought it was immortal. Wow, this thing is this thing's got moves. Oh well. Oh, oh yeah, I got him in a frame trap now. Huh. This thing can turn on a dime! Look at it! <sighs> it just sounds really irritated when I poke it. Like, ugh, stop. Oh my god. This just, this sucks. So is this a god? Is this what one would... Oh, okay, it's gone. Is that all you got? Pretty wimpy for a god, if you ask me. Do I need to lure it out with my butt? Maybe it ran away. Maybe it's maybe it's hungry for butt. Maybe move too far from the tower. Who knows? Hello, what is this? Oh, it's another it's another lost artifact. Boo. Maybe I should be following the moon. Oh, Jesus. Are you sure you're supposed to be out right now, man? I was supposed to do something when two lightning strikes happened. I'm freaking out. Tell me what to do. I'm gonna pass this resting place into the darkness. Hmm. Is this its resting place? Ah. Uh. It certainly looks horrifying. 
Okay, this is our final battle. Our new ruler, the Emperor. The door of fate is opening. Finally, friends. Ha ha ha. Dogs of the AMS. Time they made a move. Take that. Take that pillar. Huh. Yeah. Yo. Hello. <laughs> That was pretty sick, actually. Like, that was a good strat. I'm striking you down! From hate's heart, I'm stabbing at thee! Oh! Fully bonked me off the skateboard. Homing. Okay, I need to get you away from. Okay, 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 okay. He's he stole my surfboard. Oh, all right. <laughs> he's like, oh, strats, huh? I'll show you strats. <laughs> It lies defeated. We shall eat well tonight. So this has been the um, <clears throat> the fishing horror jam. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, if you want to play these games for yourself, I'm getting I'm getting hot news right now that there's actually way more to at least fishing vacation. Uh, so there may be more to uh, to these other games. Um, you can find information to download all of these in the description below the video. Um, you can also. Uh, find more information about me um, on social media uh, at the Siege Ninja on Twitter and Mastodon on Facebook.com slash S15 Studios and on my personal website S-15 Studios If you really enjoyed this uh, and you want to help me out and get cool benefits like getting early access to short fiction that I write um, including The Boyfriend Virus um, Borderland and uh, Order Versus uh, as well as getting early access to videos like this, uh, please do consider supporting me on patreon.com slash s15studios. I want to thank all my patrons. I want to thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.